guys and assalamu alaikum welcome to my new blog post blog post 17 and in this blog post i'm going to discuss about uh, <clears throat> how we can actually get uh, top n values from uh, our visual uh, how we can actually set that uh, so let's start so in order to understand this i have created a uh, uh, stack bar chart uh, and uh, this pro product basically this stack bar chart basically contains two values like on the vertical axis it contains the name of various products and there are so many that you can actually see and then on the x-axis the unit price is actually coming in so what if i would like to see the top 20 products with respect to the unit price how can i actually do that so let's learn about it so for this i need to go to the filters and from the uh, filters on this visual i need to select like what filter type should i uh, have this like right now i have three options advanced filtering basic filtering and top end so i will select the top end and then I will see, I will write 20 over here. Sorry. Um, Twenty over here. And um, right now there will be no impact on the filter. If I will not give something over here, over here, like with respect to which value I would like to see. So I would like to see the top and products with respect to the unit price so if i say this so for this i need to go to the fields i need to go to the sales and then i need to pick the unit price and drag it over here and then i will click on the apply filter and you will see that right now there are only 10 products coming in um, on my y-axis uh, sorry 20 products top 20 products so uh, what about like choosing the highest one with respect to the unit price so if i write one over here and i will click on the apply filter i will get the highest um, product with respect to the unit price so this is one way to look into the things. Uh, this filter also gives you another option, which is like a bottom, like I need to see the lowest value or the least value coming from the bottom with respect to the unit price. So when I will apply the bottom filter, I, will, I can click on the apply filter after setting the value and I will get the value which is actually at the least uh, unit price value which is actually uh, if i say like it's more than a dollar now uh, what if i would like to see the last 20 or the least 20 values so when i will click on the apply filter it will give me the least 20 values uh, coming from highest to lowest uh, sorted with respect to the highest and the lowest values you know, of the unit price so this is basic uh, concept of the unit of the top end filter by utilizing the stack stack bar chart so i hope so you have understood the concept please do not forget to like subscribe and share my youtube channel yasser fazal and as always please spread the knowledge Thank you.